Greetings. Uh, Il Grandioso is making caramelized pear and gorgonzola popovers. So I have caramelized brown sugar here with a little bit of water and butter. I'll add juice of half an orange. Some ginger powder. As you can see, it's now bubbly. Then I have two pears. Maybe you can use an apple, I have never tried it. Or a combination of both. So let that swim and bathe and vet in the caramel. Some people would add uh, caraway seeds here or cardamom seeds, but I prefer it a little simpler. If it's too spicy, it would be too much for me. So that has uh, cooked a little bit in the caramel. So we can turn that off. And then we put it a little bit to the side. I would suggest being careful not to put too much of the caramel syrup, otherwise it will probably manage to escape the, the phyllo dough. It will run out. It will run out of run over. Run out. Yep. You have it. Maybe it's a good idea to wipe off the extra. It's flowing out. Extra syrup. It's flowing out. And then the secret ingredient, creamy gorgonzola. One of my favorite cheeses. And then with egg, you do it on the sides so that it closes when you I added a little bit of water in this uh, scramble egg mixture. Let me close it. Jazz it up with the fork so it looks nicer. Again with the egg, the scrambled eggs. black car uh, caraway seeds and then we bake it to a golden brown 12 to 15 minutes gas mark 5 
Where's my... So this is how I do it, so it's a lot easier. Gas mark 5, 12 to 15 minutes. And this is what it looks like. Just delish. Guten Appetit. Mm. A triumph. <laughs>